What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Nico's Property Show. I will have to say top of the morning to you. Check this out. Alrighty, y'all, before we start this video, I did want to say thank you to everybody who is buying merch and supporting. If you haven't yet, check out nicospropertyshow.com. And if you want this duplex plan, it is the Nico duplex. You can also get that link down in the description below. But let's get on with the video. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Nico's Property Show. I will have to say top of the morning to you. Check this out. It is getting cold. It is fall, y'all. Literally, it's getting colder out here. Check out this van right here. When you see a van like this pull up, that tells you one thing. That means the framers have shown up on site. So we got some guys out here. They're setting everything out. They got the chalk lines out. They're making sure they got the placement for all the walls, the seal plates, and everything like that. Y'all can see the lumbers back there as well. What we're gonna do is we're gonna walk around. I wanna show y'all this lumber package. My lumber package, I'm getting it from 84 Lumber. And right now, the price has kind of come in at about, 16 to 17,000 without any extras that'll come obviously as we progress in the entire process of the framing um, with the walls and the roof system and everything like that and the sheathing but as you can see we've got two by fours two by sixes we got fire rated plywood we've got dense glass because this is a duplex we will need to actually get a wall in the middle of the duplex that is fire rated for two hours so if this place ever does light on fire it gives the people next door time to get up out of there without it just flaming up their house so anyway Anyways, a lot of lumber here. Lumber prices have gone down since about eight to 12 months ago. I was paying double the price for the same amount of lumber, literally less actually. So very excited for that. About to get all these walls up. These guys are gonna be knocking this thing out. This is exciting. We finally are gonna have a house here. So anyways, enough talking for me. We're gonna get them shooting all these chalk lines and everything. We're gonna get them getting straight to work. All right, y'all, so the framers are about to start. Look at this right here, man. Breakfast of champions. What, cappuccino? Mm -hmm. Cappuccino, blueberry, mm -hmm. blueberry muffin, and he's gonna frame this entire house. You're gonna be muy famoso, my mm -hmm. brother. We got you, bro. <laughs> he's like, mm-hmm, I got you. <laughs> not, not saying anything, yo, but again, shout out to my neighbor, Chris. He's gonna let us use power because we still haven't been able to get EPB out here because what they're gonna be doing is actually going from that light pole, boring under the road and adding a new transformer box and everything over here. But they're about to get started. I'm excited. I love when people come out with a good attitude. I'm telling you, on the construction site, when there's good attitudes, good people just feeling good, this whole thing works out, man. When people are sad, it's just like, oh, this sucks. Great crew. Um, you saw Boss Man Enrique right there. Black and white construction. They take care of all the framing. They can take care of all kinds of stuff. They'll take care of the roofing, the shingles, um, siding, everything like that. So anyways, they're about to get started. I'm gonna get out of the way. We're gonna keep filming. This is gonna be awesome, man. All right, y'all, I'm here with this giant box of sill plate sealer. It's gonna go on the concrete here between the concrete and the green board or pressure treated wood. It's basically to keep out bugs and to insulate the house more from any heating and cooling that could escape. Uh, it'll make your house more efficient. It'll, you know, you don't want the ants crawling in the kitchen, so you gotta put some of this stuff down. If you're ever building a house, put it in. It's like $7 per roll. I mean, so you can just, it's basically as wide as the two by four. It's three and a half inches, so. It'll seal out anything and it goes right over these bolts. You don't have to do nothing, just press it over and then it'll just make your house better in the long run.
Alrighty y'all, so you're like, wait, what just happened? Where's all the framing? Shoot that way real quick. Check this out. That is creating this, which in reality is basically all of this right here. So all the walls that are making up this duplex and I am so happy, I'm literally ecstatic. Um, I wanna jump in from this side, kind of show you, this is one side of the duplex. They are working on the backside walls right there. This is the literal front door. So we're gonna show you a rendering right here of the duplex again so you can get a better idea. So right here you have the front door of the left side and then walking in, you can see the living room and the kitchen area. And then of course we have a bedroom and a bathroom as well behind us. So we are hanging out here in the living room and kitchen slash dining to the left. If we go down this hallway right here, we are in a bathroom over here. If you can see me walking in, this is a bathroom. And the other side, the back side of this over here, um, will you see in a second, will be another bathroom in a closet on the other side of a bedroom, which is kind of the master because it all connects into one. And then back here on the right corner, we have bedroom number two, and then we will have like a washer and dryer utility area that goes out the back door where you can go hang out on the back patio because we will do a concrete slab back there. This feels amazing. This will be replicated on the other side of the house right there. They are going crazy, just ba -ba 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 -ba. They're going, I mean, this is amazing. I'm literally so happy seeing these walls go up. It makes the, the slab become a home. It makes these plans become a reality. And I just want to show y'all, man, big shout out to hpzplans.com right here. House Plan Zone. I built my first house with them and then now I'm building a duplex with them. If you want, down in the description below, you can get the Nico duplex. Go check it out. If you want to build this sucker, if you want to just go through and look at all their house plans, you can do that as well. Amazing company. They are so quick. They get changes done if you need them. This is amazing. I'm so happy. I feel it at the bottom of my heart. Drop your comments down below. Let me know what you think about this entire process, at least this half, because once we start on this one, this is literally going to be a house. I mean, it's unreal and I love walking through the wall while you still can um, because as soon as we start putting up like the dense glass and everything to make this wall fire rated we won't be able to do that which we have that dense glass back there we'll be running that up the entire wall all the way up to the roof line so that if this side ever catches on fire it doesn't cause that side to catch on fire right away it gives them a two hour window and things like that there's so many different things that I will be talking about um, I mentioned earlier that my framing package was about sixteen thousand dollars then we'll have some extras Hey, I hope we don't need extras to be honest. Hopefully we have too much that we can send back and get more of a discount, but can't wait to get this thing done. All these walls and just keep progressing, man. This is awesome. Nico's Property Show is here to kind of entertain you and teach you. So we're gonna keep on moving, keep on getting them working and get some awesome shots. y'all they're about to put this last back wall up in the duplex so let's see what they got biggest wall All right, y'all, we're back from lunch. The guys are back from lunch. They said they went to a Mexican place. They said it was absolutely amazing. They got to get the energy so they could finish this house for us. They're finishing up the side that they worked on this morning. They got a few more rooms to close. They got a few doors to put up. And once that side is done, they're going to start on the other side to be able to get ready to sheet the outside of the house so that they can start the roof system. So they're going to finish this side. Then they're going to start that side. Let's watch them get that done and then get the sheathing up. Already, y'all, so the framers are making great progress. If you check it out right now, what they're doing is putting on the dense glass. Literally, it says it on 
the board that they're putting on. And this is gonna be what allows that wall to be fire rated. So you can see them carrying it over. It's not light either. Um, so what they're doing right here is applying this and they're gonna go down the straight line of it. And then they're gonna use it where they stagger it, kind of like a brick pattern so that it's nice and secure there. And come over here, I'll show you. There will be a one inch gap between this wall and this wall, like I told y'all earlier, just so it has that space. So if that side catches on fire, this side doesn't catch on fire right away. Um, they're moving pretty darn quick. What we did is we got some uh, sheetrock or drywall screws and you do have to screw it in so it's nice and tight because if you shoot through with a nail gun, it'll probably bust it honestly and it won't be holding on. So we got those screws for them. Everything's turning out great. We're gonna get out of their way. So much noise. We're just gonna keep filming, get awesome shots. This is amazing. I'm so happy to be at this process um, and just keep on growing from it. So anyways, let's get more shots. Alrighty y'all, so it is the end of the day. The framers are gone and I have to grab the trailer in the morning, bring them some 20 foot two by fours and they're gonna honestly finish out all the walls on the inside, get them all level and plumb and then they're gonna start probably with the sheathing um, with the plywood around the edges and then they're gonna get onto that roof system and everything like that um, with the ceiling joists and everything. So I am excited, it looks beautiful. You guys can see, it's a nice view. Come show them a little bit closer before we head out of here. Um, it just turned out beautiful. I was able to get the blower on it, get it nice and cleaned out and it just gives you a solid vibe of what it's gonna feel like when it's actually done. And basically, we're just gonna end it right here and we will be back in the morning. This is gonna be awesome. I cannot wait to get this done. They said it's about a week long project for them to get all the framing knocked out. We got the dense glass up. They gotta do it on the other side and then they're gonna leave that inch gap. And this thing is just gonna keep moving. So anyways, I will see y'all here in the morning. Top of the morning to you folks. We are back here on the property and the framers are full go at it. We had to grab the trailer this morning and grab them some more 16 foot two by fours because they need it for that top sill plate that goes along the top. Right now they are applying more dense glass on the middle walls that will be separating the duplex from each side of each other with that one inch air gap in between. So they showed up, they are straight to work. It's nice when we're here in the morning and everything is rolling. They're in good moods. They're happy to be here at work and they are knocking it out. Very excited to get this process. There will be a little more explanation stuff that I will go through as they continue to put these walls up. They're almost completely done with this entire side. I think there's one, two, three, four, maybe four more little walls that they'll put up and then they'll actually get the, uh, the all of it nice level and plumb and then they'll be able to sheathe all the way around with the plywood that you can see right here. All this nice stuff right here, um, which I believe is OSB if I'm not mistaken, but lumber prices have gone down tremendously. I'm excited for that. I'm excited for this thing to get done so we can start progressing, get the shingles on the roof, get it covered up. That way we can work inside even if it's raining. But without further ado, let's get them working.
Alrighty y'all, so everybody's back from lunch and the framers are about to get started on this sheathing. So what they're doing is getting everything squared up over there, getting all their lines set so they know exactly where they need to put this plywood. As you can see, um, this is some really good clean stuff. I'm excited. It's all stacked up in the front here for them so they're gonna have to carry all of it from the back. So this came on the second run where they were able to place this up here. So they'll use it for the front half of the house and then the back half of the house, they'll use what we have back there. And then they'll be able to move on to the ceiling joists and everything like that which will come up in a different video because I didn't want to put way too much content in one video. So they're about to knock this out. This is going to be pretty darn cool. Um, it's really neat to see how this all works out and how this goes around the entire house. So this is going to be awesome. They got the chalk lines out right now and I'm going to get some of this film for you. Alrighty y'all, so the framers are completely done and I am super excited with the progress. They did a clean job and they were in a great mood. You might see this red plywood right there and think to yourself, what in the world is that? That is actually a fire rated plywood and it has to go four feet to each side from that center wall. So remember where we had that one inch air gap with the dense glass on each side, that goes four feet that way and four feet that way. And you can also see it through there. It's on the back side as well. And that will actually run up the roof just like that runs and then you'll see the regular plywood around the edges and everything like that because that doesn't need to be fire rated so we are very happy with all the progress here all the rooms look great you saw all that walk through and everything i mean check this out we are almost ready to get somebody moved in here i'm excited cannot wait for everything to continue just to keep progressing get this thing done so we can finally just be at the final stages but we got to remember, we got to enjoy the process as well. So anyways, I think it's time to end out this video. Alrighty y'all, so it is time to end out this video. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you like and subscribe and make sure you follow me on Nico's Property Show on all social platforms if you want behind the scenes stuff. And if you haven't yet, check out nicospropertyshow.com, grab you some merch. And if you want this Nico duplex, you can also find that in the description below with House Plan Zone. Very happy with how all this is turning out. Hope you guys are enjoying it. And without further ado, smile more, worry less, and stay blessed. I'll see you on the next video. Peace out.